we got this other meeting we got to get to. Okay, okay, we're about to get it. Go True. Right yeah, so this joint is going to be like probably a 10 to 15 minute interview, and then um, we'll cut it from there, and then you should be good to go. Okay. Whatever you want to do. Cool, cool. So I'll start it off with a regular intro. Yeah. I'll tell everybody, please forgive our makeshift setup. Usually we're not this ratchet. Yeah. <laughs> usually we got the microphone, we got everything usually yeah, tight. Yeah. But they pulled a fast one on me last night. Actually, they didn't. It's their conference. So. <laughs> they, they needed the information. Well, we call it what we call it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Ty, we ready when you are, bro? Hold on, I'm just trying to... I was gonna do automatic, but I don't like how I keep zooming in. I'm about to get in the camera like, listen to me. <laughs> we get crazy. We get crazy. We standing up and all that. Yeah. Like, <laughs> you know how to. Crazy. All right, three. Yeah. What's up? What's up? Listen, it's the Fake Famous Podcast. You already know what time it is. It's your man, C. Goss, and I'm with the most irresponsible father in the world. <laughs> Yo, this man keep calling me irresponsible because I got five kids and five kids on purpose. Who do you know that has five kids on purpose? Nobody. People that's married and no, having sex. No, bro. <laughs> on about? purpose? Like, two on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> but three, three more? more. Nah, yeah. bro. I'm not buying that. Three more, man. Most irresponsible father in the uh, world. I, we'll see. We got young Chris in the building. What's up, everybody? What's up? Yeah, yeah. And as y'all can see, uh, huh? Uh, we uh, gonna take you back to your childhood. Hold on, hold on. 2001, 2002. Ah! Let's go. They don't listen, know about it. Listen, listen, listen. So I don't know if y'all remember this or not, but I remember. I remember. <laughs> this is like the. This- so <laughs> this is like start of reality TV. I was yeah, about to say that. Like, yeah. I was about to say that. Yo, shout out to Puff. Yeah. So listen. Puff had this show, Making the Band, right? That, like, went through, like, and crushed everybody, crushed Facts. everything. Everybody was, like, sold on it, watching, tuning in every single week, right? And we are so blessed, we are so humbled to have the one and only Mysterious! Yeah. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? She's with us live in yes, studio. In the building. In yeah. my bad, get, you, uh, your name's not Mysterious anymore. No, you changed I, it, right? Yes, I changed it. What's it your name? Mysterious, but it's just the AKA Misty. Misty Blanco. Misty Blanco. That's tough. That's I ain't gonna hold you. That's hard. Misty, Misty Blanco. Blanco. Uh, let's D-A? D-A? They don't know about it. They don't know. She's live. She's in these streets. We got her right here. We so benefit, or we feel so humbled. Word. It's such a benefit to have her here. Because I got questions, Misty. Okay, yeah, I'll we do too. We we as soon as Christina you. told me, we got who? Misty Yo, she oh, said, first of all, she put in the chat. Yo, we got Misty Cup. We said, bet. Set it up. <laughs> Set it up. Set it up. Yeah, big up to Christina, man. I love word, her. Word. Set it up, smack. <laughs> so look, so look, um, just starting off. Cause you know, we in a whole new generation. Yeah. We in a whole new, you know, these kids. They, they, don't, they don't know what's they going know. on. They just they know Misty Blanco. They, they do. Know mysterious. <laughs> that is a fact. So give us the background <laughs> of why, who you are, who you are, and why. You know, you so popping. Uh-huh. <laughs> Well, I'm the bad kid for making it bad. <laughs> the bad guy who wanted to be solo, who went against the rules with Diddy. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's me. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Away. First one wild out, breaking glass, showing people passion. I remember that. It makes TV. Like you broke the glass. Like, yo, she yeah. broke the glass. She just squeezed yeah. the joint. And- <laughs> I remember that, yo. That was crazy. That was, that, was a, that was some liquor, and it was also, you know, passion. Yeah. Based, you know. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah. You also wow. had a, a, some stuff going on family-wise yeah. at the time, yeah. too. True. But, you know, to be honest with you, it was like the lawyer that I had, you mm. know, he told me about the contract. Word, word. So he said the worst thing you can do is actually be in the band. Oh, wow. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We, we got <laughs> to take it back. We got to take it back. How did you find out about the show? Uh, oh man, that's crazy. Oh uh, my god, brother Nugget, shout out to Nugget. You know, if it wasn't for him, the world wouldn't know me. Mm. You know, he came and told me that Diddy was looking for a band, and I was like, a band? I ain't trying to be in no band. <laughs> like, you know, I said, and it's, I said, who was it for? He's like, Diddy. I said, man, I ain't wearing no shiny suits. Like, I, ain't to, I ain't trying to do that. So they tricked me, actually. And you know, everybody know I like to eat, Christine. You know, I like to eat. <laughs> <laughs> in Virginia, what happened? How much food I ordered? <laughs> I like, hey, I Three like, restaurants. Oh, <laughs> Back to bed. That's crazy. <laughs> so he's like, oh, we're going to take you get something to eat. Got in the car, and then we kept passing all these restaurants. And I'm like, yo, like, what's going on? <laughs> and I'm in the back with the child lock. Mm. He tricked me, you know. Bam. So we get all the way downtown um, to the Fox Theater. Shout out to the Fox Theater where he had it. And they had a line wrapped around like four buildings. 
And I say, are you serious? I'm not getting out and, and standing at the end of this line. Yeah. I'm never getting in. So Nuggie was like, and my baby father, shout out to my baby father, he was there too. Um, he was like, um, let's walk the line and then you'll know somebody and they'll probably let you get in front. Because I was popping already in right. Detroit in the underground. Okay. Are you from the D? Yeah, I'm from the D. We're we going to get into that later. We're going to get into that. <laughs> Go ahead. Yeah, yeah, so, <laughs> got to get into um, that. I'm um, seeing some people that I knew. They let me get in front of them, and then Fire. it started raining. Oh snap! And then the crowd dispersed. Right, the security came out. They was like, "We only letting like ten more people in." Now it's like thirty of us out there. Oh man! So everybody was like, "You remember that song by Ludacris?" Woo! Yeah, 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 yeah. So everybody started doing that. And my baby father snuck behind security. I was like, "Come on!" <laughs> and I oh, actually snuck snap. in. Got in the foyer. It was like a bunch of people in the foyer, and then this lady came out. Shout out MTV. She said, "I'm taking one more person." She pointed at me and said, "You come on." Everybody started. What? Walking. Like we've been staying here for hours. Yeah, yeah. Again. And that's how it's been. Yo, so it was like fate. Uh, it was fate. It was so fate. like you oh. knew that you was about to be on. Like I, 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 I couldn't believe it. I mean, I was <laughs> one of the people who fought with themselves. I yeah. don't know if there's people out there like that where you. It be the the carpet be rolled out for you, but right. you be your own enemy. Yeah. Right, so right, it was right. already being rolled out, and right, I was right. like, ah, this came in. Right. But God kept on pushing me through. Right. Right. Sure. Right. Right. Sure. So with you being in the underground scene, like you didn't feel like it it was necessary for you to even have to do this, right? Like you. Didn't... I didn't understand the just of it all, cause it was like you know the underground. That's the underground. You know anything mm. goes. Like it is that's... what it is, and then when you get on national TV, like MTV, yeah, the lights yeah. is on like yeah, this. Yeah, like, it's yeah, like, whoa, yeah. what is going on? So, yeah, right. you know, I didn't really think that I, I had low self-esteem, you know, to be honest with you, I, I had low self-esteem about my looks. Mm -hmm. I had low self-esteem about my weight. I had low self-esteem about my voice. Mm -hmm. So, it, in the underground, it felt I felt like, you know, you could be whatever, you yeah. know, but on the mainstream, when you looking yeah, at people yeah. like Eve and all them, I'm yeah. like, man, I, I, don't, I don't fit in with this. Fam, I could imagine though, cause like we're talking about Puff. Yeah. So like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Puff has a look. Yeah. That he's probably yeah. going for. And you know what? I had actually, when I, I got a chance, you know, making it through the auditions and right. stuff. Right. Right. And when I finally seen him, I was the first person he actually picked to come to New York. But when we finally got a chance to sit down and talk, big up to Puff. I had said that to him. I wow. had expressed my insecurities. And Puff yeah. looked at me and said, you talking to the man who signed Biggie and Craig Mack. That's a fact. Uh, and I was like, uh, oh. That's a good point. <laughs> yeah, like, oh, wait, right, no. That's a good so point. He, yeah, so okay. I still kind of was my worst, kind of, I was my worst enemy on a lot of things with that. Yeah, so when you say, when you say underground, you, it wasn't like the free, because that was the freestyle era, that was the battle the era. Like, what was you, Boy, I was, was you pulling up on people, battling people? I like, used to battle. Oh, let's get it. Final twelve, but what I liked about Diddy That's was crazy. he the audition was about being a star yeah, and yeah. not so much battling. Yeah, right? yeah, you had to have your interviews together. You had to have personality. Yeah. You had to have performance. You had to make songs. Right, right. So it's so crazy that when I came to the audition, I was already equipped. Mm. You know, a lot of people was just battling, and I I shut down the auditions with songs. Crazy, right? Yeah. Come through with full fledged radio records, ready to go. Yeah. <laughs> so, then, that, that whole making a band, though, I, I, if I could go back, I would do it all over again. Word. I so, would. Yeah, that's fire. That's fire. It's only one thing I would do different. All right, all right, I dig that. One thing I'll do different. Well, which is what? When he brought me back, right? And did y'all see when he brought me back? I, I watched the whole yeah. thing. Listen, I'm an avid watcher. <laughs> yeah. I go I back now on YouTube up, and watch the videos. You know, I messed up when Diddy's like, so how you doing? You know, we was worried about you hearing Bad Boy and yeah. what are you doing? And I, I please don't be caught up in your own mind. You know mm. what I'm saying? To where Diddy was like, so what can I do? That was my moment to say to Diddy, like, yo, let me go against the band. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It should have been mysterious against the band. Yeah, you know, like they make though. the rawest album. But <laughs> I'm sitting there all emotional still about me not making the band, and I seeing God again. Right, yeah. that He's pushing me, like yeah. sitting me right yeah. there. I'm like, what? <laughs> I'm making mixtapes. I'm I'm messing with Wendy Williams, which was yeah. his arch enemy. Like, right, right, right. <laughs> right. 
You right. Know, so I would right. definitely yeah. change that conversation. <laughs> so 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 the band is over, right? And you like this international superstar now. Because everybody was rooting for you. Yeah. Like everybody's like, yo, we want the yeah, Stanley to win. Yeah. Like we yo, so come fun. on, Puff, add her in the group, right. blah, 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 right? And she was one of the best on there. That's like, a fact. As you know, well, I mean, yeah. personally, I would have picked you over Dylan, but yeah, yeah. you know oh what? No shout out to Dylan. No, <laughs> no, <laughs> no shout out. <laughs> out. Word. I mean, I be seeing Dylan. He be showing me love and stuff, but you know, he be a little phony sometimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 No, no so it's out. like no shout out. No to shout out to Dylan. <laughs> All right, mysterious, 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 mysterious. mysterious. Right, right, right. Once I saw, once I saw E, that's on the joint. You know, I was sold once I saw yeah. E. Yeah, 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 that's, yeah. That's was. That's was fire. Oh my god. I was right there him. Uh, what's his name? <sighs> was it Jay Mills? Oh, the battle. battle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh man, he made uh, he made um uh Ness bust on the sweat. That's the yeah. first person I seen. Yeah, Mills was, Mills was Mills different. was nasty. Mills was a beast. That battle was yeah, yeah. so nah, intense. One hundred percent, one hundred percent. So so you I guess you transitioned from making the band. Now your brand is bigger now yeah. because now you're mysterious from making the band. Yes. So do you go back to Detroit? Do you stay in New yeah, York? I so oh Detroit, you like a star in Detroit yeah, now, I bet. Yeah, I always, <laughs> my city was so happy I made um on international TV with MTV because again I was doing my thing underground. Right. I was like the youngest female rapper and you know how they had them awards. Mm. I was winning awards already. Yeah. Yeah. So to make it on making a band it's like I became a legend. Cause yeah. at the time you had M, shout out to M, that was, that's my crew. True. You know, B12 and them, and Word. Eight Mile Movie just came out. Fire. They doing their thing, yeah. so yeah. I'm doing my thing. Jumping. It was jumping, you know. So, yeah. so I, got, I got a question for you. This is kind of off topic. You really think, and he go, they both be tight. <laughs> I'm about to be tight. They about to be tight. <laughs> you think? Do you think Big Sean is nice like that? Yeah, okay. I like Big Sean. That's a, no, no. Boy, Her no. face said it all. No, Her no. face said it Bro. all. Her face said it all. Okay, moving on. Go ahead. You got a question? That's my go ahead, boy. Sorry. I'm going to hate it. Go ahead. Yeah, yeah, you got a question? He's not Royce. This guy's not Royce. I didn't say he was right. You're acting like he's not good. The thing with Big Sean is his business is solidified. And then he did the whole college movement. And that's what made him blow. You know what I'm saying? I respect it, though. I respect it. You know, shout out Big Sean. I love you, boy. You know what I'm saying? Like, he's... Now, like, so, like, a female coming out of Detroit, it's already tough being a female in the industry who raps and is not selling sex, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, like, a female coming out of Detroit on the underground scene, were there a lot? Or is it, like, you versus everybody? Or, like, in you Detroit. versus the dudes? Yeah, yeah, in Detroit. Oh, they had a lot of um, MCs, like, Miss Corona, you got to check okay. her out. They had Diffusion. Um, that's a terrible name it, right now, Miss Corona. Miss Corona. <laughs> By the way, that's a terrible name. She gotta change her name now. She like, gotta change her name yesterday. She ain't getting booked for the rest of the month. Never get booked. She ain't getting booked from now to twenty twenty five. Miss Corona, you got uh, uh, a red. She okay. out there, which was Swifty McVeigh from Dick B Twelve Sister. Yeah, it was a few word. people, but the legend out there, like our godmother, is boss. Okay. Y'all remember Boss? Yeah, yeah, that sounds familiar. Nah, nah, deeper yeah. Deeper and deeper. That sounds okay, familiar. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, I did not know that. That's crazy. Yeah, she from, she's from D. Detroit. Yeah, she's from D. Like, I love her. So. Detroit low key is slept on, though. Slept. Super slept on. <laughs> like, super like, slept on. Yeah, really slept yeah. on a whole really? lot. Eminem? Nah, yeah, but, but like, but like, they're not that's, getting their props for real, There's so many MCs. So in Detroit, many. Like, that's better than that. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I agree. Mean, cool, yeah, but like, yeah, yeah. I mean, nah, no, totally saying, like, you gotta, once you come to Detroit and come to the heart of it all, I'm yeah, talking yeah. about yo. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot. Detroit is music history, though. Yeah, it is. Oh yeah, Motown. Oh, yeah. In, in, in Motown, gospel, everything. Like, mm -hmm. yeah, Detroit is music history. Nah, that's a fact. It's a fact. So, what would you say is like, I guess, your biggest lessons that you learned uh, just from transitioning? From making the band and like international stardom, going back to where you're going now, and then where, where you're at now, like what's the biggest lesson that mm -hmm. you've learned? Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's an awesome question. Uh, what I learned was to control my emotions. Mm. Um, it's business, it's not personal. Mm. Right? Um, a lot of us take this this industry and make it personal. Yeah. You know, um, another thing I learned is really be careful of the people you have in your corner. Right. Right. Because at the end of the day, some people may be smiling like they want you to make it, but real rap, they don't. Mm. Jealousy. And be careful of your love life. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Because if you're not with the right person that's going to push you, I suggest you just be single until you get where you're going. Yeah. You know, because that's where my downfall came in at. Because right. 
once I got married to the wrong person, we weren't equally yoked. Yeah. You know, and as a woman, we're the receiver. So right. whatever he's given, I'm going to dish out, yeah. you know? So yeah. right. it was a lot of things that was going on in my personal life where I'm trying to be with my husband, but the industry calling me and mm. he being abusive and he wasn't like, you know, it's a lot. So those are the three main lessons. Like, and the best thing I could tell somebody is get it. Like, close your yeah. eyes and you go. go for it. Right. I don't care what's in front of you. I'd have been home. Like, when I was on making a band, my baby followed me in. You know, I ain't going to say your name, you know. <laughs> but that's still my best friend, you know. Word, word, um, we were we were squatting wow. in the crib. A lot of people ain't know I was homeless. Wow. But you got to get it. You got to get it. easy, yo. You know, so I be hearing some people now, they be like, I can't do this because of this, and I can't. I be yeah. looking at them like you don't really want it. Yep. So y'all wasn't y'all wasn't getting a check for being on the show. Once we got in the house, you get it. Okay. Yeah, we started. Diddy was giving us nice little money every four days. Shout out Diddy. Oh no, every four days. Four days. Oh, four days. I, I never heard of a job paying every four days. I need something like that. Four days, yo, um, wow. you mentioned business taking. You know, don't take uh, business person. I think that that's hard because. Business is attached to your craft. Exactly. Every creative takes their craft personal. Exactly. So how do you separate the two? Um, this is what I would do. Put yourself in the other person's shoes that's across the desk. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, because a lot of times artists don't want to invest in themselves either. Like, you want to approach these people and be like, I'm high, I'm high. And they be like, okay, what did you put into yourself? You want me to spend all this money on you, but you don't believe in yourself enough mm. to spend money on yourself. Fair you know, <laughs> um, put it on YouTube. Some you know people mean? can't take constructive criticism, mm. you know, or if you come in the game thinking somebody owe you something wow. because you worked hard, then you you really didn't jacked up because I'd have had right. a, a manager, yeah. uh, nameless, because I don't give no no fame to nobody. Yeah, you know, but right. we was going through the industry and he act like people owed uh, or yeah. something or owed me something and that was totally the wrong way to go about things yeah. you know coming in like you know i'm mysterious i got a story and da -da -da -da. who don't have a story yeah you know what i'm saying what makes my story so much different than the next person or why should this person cut me a check just because i'm mysterious right you know i ain't put in no work mm. you know so that's really the, the the worst approach to come is acting like somebody owe you something they don't care they don't care if, like I said, if you're homeless, if if you want you want welfare, they don't care if you got twenty thousand kids. They mm. want to know the business. Mm -hmm. How can I make money from you? How can we make money together? And what will be the influential point of me signing? Right, right, because right. you're talking about millions and billions yeah. of people. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because I'm yeah. thinking, I used to be thinking on a small level, because I didn't even know how big making a band was, actually. Yeah. So That's when my I whole was, childhood experience. <laughs> yeah. I know all your records, man. Yeah. <laughs> I, was, I was running around, and people like, you know, mysterious people just be jumping. I'm like, and I'm still thinking Detroit East Side. Um, you know, you don't even know. I didn't even know. Yeah. Like, you know, so yeah. you got to really be mm -hmm. able to do that, separating your emotions, like, and taking constructive criticism and understanding the other person on the other side of the desk. Yeah. Because they got right. bosses. Yeah, and they so got to yeah. make sense. Right, they right. Mess with you can't so be a um, how different? How different is the game today? Like, do you think there's a, it's a drastic difference between, you know, back in 01, 02, with, uh, other than streaming being number one thing? Like, how different is the business side of it since you know what i'm saying the business side is pretty much the same mm -hmm. because everybody else is basically being their old boss own bosses right. but to me back then was better yeah i mm -hmm. swear to god it was better because if you doing it okay this is a shout out to everybody that's doing it on their own right, you know right, right. i mean because you put your money up you you getting some real streams some fake streams Hey, do you know do your thing. Uh, <laughs> I think back in the day was better because you really had artist development. You really had A and R's. Mm. You really had it to where you really had to be dope. S H I T. Yeah, 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 yeah. You yeah, had, yeah, to, yeah, really yeah. had be to be fire. dope. Now you get online and everybody online, and you be like, yo, he whack. Oh, so what? He got 19 million views. What does that exactly. mean? Exactly. <laughs> he it's whack. Fact. You know what I'm exactly. saying? So I'm still. I got the Missy TV firm and I'm still Let's back go. in the day. Yeah, yeah. She'll tell you, I'm, I'm hitting the pavement. I'm hitting yeah. the pavement. Let's you know? go into that one time. So yeah. so so we transitioned from Mysterious to Misty Blanca, which yeah. I love. Yeah. That's fine. Tell, who is Misty Blanca? Okay, I, I, I'm happy you asked that. Okay, so Mysterious is the dark me. Okay. Know? That's the the struggle, the story, the 
you know, where I come from. Misty is short, okay. and mysterious, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And Blanco, everybody knows, means white impurity. So I right. purify myself. Mm -hmm. I gotcha, turn gotcha. myself white. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Not white, but right. white. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so it's like Black the yin and the yang. <laughs> the yin and the yang. So okay. um, I got the name Blanco, too, because I like Griselda Blanco. <laughs> But I didn't want to be like shout out Lil Kim and everybody that do mm -hmm. you know we all the foremost. But I didn't want to be like Lil Kim and them that keep calling themselves Griselda. Yeah. So I just and I think the last name is dope. So I just took put it yeah. on to Misty. That works. Yeah. That works. And I've heard some records. And they're fire. Yeah. I've heard some joints <laughs> Christina sent me. Yeah. It was I'm fire. Tough, so Thank you. You know what I'm saying? I was like, yo, these are the ones. Yeah, I was hard. like, yo, Misty's back, son. Yeah. <laughs> Misty's hard. back. You and feel she, me? She's still, you know, with the lyricism, but then you add some of the sauce yeah, to it. So it's dope. <laughs> you know, shout out Future and um Ricky, because they had sent me some records and it was funny. Y'all, did you send the right the right Yeah. Yeah, that was the one I was telling you. That was the one. That was the one. one. That was the one. That was the one. was like, yo. Cause when I first got the record, I was trying to do my voice and rap on it. Right. And <laughs> the teacher was like, "No, no, you can't, you, you can't." Like, nah, that's not it. You gotta, you gotta be soft. I said, "What? You know, I'm still mysterious. <laughs> yeah. I'm still mysterious. Yeah. You know, I, I want to go hard. So I actually was being funny. I was being sarcastic. Wow. I thought they was gonna say not. Nah. And they were like, "No, that's dope. That's dope, cute." I'm like, yeah. "Are you serious?" <laughs> <laughs> And that's yeah. how the record was made. Okay. Yeah, so you okay. got this um you got this tour thing going on called yeah. Rise of, it's Rise of the Fiery Phoenix, right? T tell us a little bit about that. Like what's that? <laughs> I'm the Fiery Phoenix. Ah. You know, and I feel like I'm gonna be an Oprah Winfrey of the hip hop game. Okay. Oh so they need to watch the ride. Yo, talk to him. Yo, yeah, talk to him. Oh, I, I, I am the, the Oprah man. Winfrey of the hip hop game. I keep saying <laughs> I like that. You know, like I find I find talent. Yeah. And these the people that I have is so dope, yeah. you know. And I'm talking about. I got a plaque last week, and I shout out to my artist Big Noon. We got a plaque. She uh, charted uh, 115 globally. Wow. Ooh, you know, so right. I got my other artists. We we hopefully we can get some plaques. But my thing is the fiery phoenix. If everybody know about my story, how I got incarcerated, mm -hmm. you know how I went off making mm -hmm. man, different things like that. You can't kill a phoenix. Okay. You know, mm. we rise from the ashes. So, Come on. So right. the ashes that, you know, was in my life from rising from it. And she's a businesswoman that I know that can do. Yeah, yeah. That's so is, is that what's next? Is that as well, far as your now. label? Now. As far as <laughs> right I'm now? The, okay. I'm the only woman. I'm the only black woman right now in the Rockefeller Center. Mm. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, I tell people. That's huge. Yeah, yeah. I tell people you, um. You should come see me in prison with an ID. Yeah. Now you got to come to my office and show that. Uh, <laughs> yo, talk to him. Don't speak to the inmate press nine no more. Listen. <laughs> you ain't got to have a hand on the glass no more. Yo, that's crazy. Correctional officers, you know, walking past the bars at Coleman, right. you know, talking right. smack. Now I'm at the Rockefeller mm. Center and they like, what can we do for you? Right, <laughs> right. You know what I'm saying? Talk about the security. So it's a, it's a great thing. You know? live in New York. I live in New Jersey right Jersey. now. Okay. Yeah. Jersey. Jersey. Jersey stand up. Word. You know? Word. Now, look, we know y'all uh, got a dip because y'all got some more press runs to do. But before you dip out, you know, we be doing a, dip, a disservice to our listeners, to our fans, and things like that. Um, first of all, you know, there's a lot of questions about Puff. That yeah, I was come like, on, give them to That me. I was like, listen, I don't want to ask her a bunch of questions about Puff. Yeah. But it was like, no, nah, ask, ask, yeah, ask, ask. So, ask, like, you know how so we I'm think about around, Puff. I'm going to stick around for a little while. Okay, so we can okay, it okay. In. All right. Now, you know how the general public perceives <laughs> Puff Daddy. Mm -hmm. You know, he got his own dance. He's like, hey, come here, bro. brush my hair for me. <laughs> do it. Like, do I mean, I'm, I'm not going to do the dance. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I don't want to do, you know, do it doing, doing dirty like that. But, like, yo, like, are those misconceptions or is that real life? Like, is Puff really like that? Um, both. Okay. Um, both. Um, meaning, like, when you a person who struggled like he did to make a name for himself with Andre Harrell, rest in peace. Mm, yeah, peace. Um, Diddy really, 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 if y'all really look at his story, he was the one that was really one of those, you know, I don't want to, what they used to call saps. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he yeah. Had a, he, had a, he had a plan. Mm -hmm. You know, he had a plan. He the one who was running out getting the coffee. He was the one washing cars. He was the one. Everything that he made us doing, making it bad, yeah. isn't something that he didn't do. That's fire. You know, That's so dope. he basically was looking for the one who, 
was determined like him and ambitious. So once he got to his boss seat, because you got to think about this, right? Yeah. How we all sit back and say, yo, I'm going to get it, I'm going to get it, I'm going to be a boss. And you know how people play you. You know, mm -hmm. people was around him like, oh, you did it. You, you know, right. you Andre mm -hmm. Real little gopher. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, so yeah. So now that he got in that seat. Yeah. It was like, yo, <laughs> man. I had to learn that, you know, because now I see myself. Y'all not gonna see me say take that, take that. But I, <laughs> I see myself feeling that same energy. Whereas, word, word. you know, I was the one in the open mics. I was the one begging to get on stage. I was the one around people. Let me get on a song with you. Let me get on a song yeah, with you. you know? yeah. Then when I got on making the band, after that, I'm the one in the street selling my own CDs. I'm still telling people I'm going to be the biggest thing. Mm. And people next to me, even though they see me on TV, I'll be looking like, damn, whatever, whatever. So <laughs> now that the light is opening up, right. I'm trying to keep myself from going like this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, know I mean? so you can't be mad at Diddy. Like, Diddy yeah, worked yeah. hard to get where he at. Like, that's what he did. Like, and he's a great businessman. Um, oh, sure, he had sure. me at, as his little um, protege, so I did learn a lot from him. Dope. He used to have me at his meetings. The crazy part about Word? it. Yeah, I used to be mad about that, though. Like, that's why if you go back mm. and see some of the episodes where uh, Mina Monroe, I was folding my clothes <laughs> in the room, and it's like the whole house ganged up on me. <laughs> Diddy would take me to the studio. He would take me to certain meetings. So they'd be like, yeah, mysterious, you know, mysterious don't want to do this. And oh, man. <laughs> you know, she's with Diddy. So it was like, right. I didn't see because I'm like, oh, I don't want to be with him. Word, word, yeah. I want to chill with y'all. I want to go to the club. I want to hang out. Yeah. He'll come through and say, mysterious, come on, you come with me. They go hang out. What's your name? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be with you, man. I'm, I'm trying, to, trying to hang out with everybody yeah. else. He saw something. Yeah, he did. He, he knew, he knew I was going to be the open room for the hip hop. He knew. <laughs> he That's knew. what it was. That's what it was. That's crazy. So, like, you know how people get on TV and they, like, turn up for TV mm -hmm. and they act a little fake or whatnot? Like, who would you say, out of everybody that you was in the house with, who was, like, the realest and who was, like, oh, you Ooh. just turned up for TV? Because mm. <laughs> I got my opinion where I'm like, nah, he's not like that for real. Uh, or nah, she's not like that for real. I mean, I'm going to flat out put this out. <laughs> Might as well, Craig. You know, at that time, I was really upset about some things. Because me and Babs actually was cool. Mm. And we still cool Shout to this to day. Shout out Babs. Playing the ring, queen of the ring. And at that time, when Diddy was bringing me back, they were so mad. Like, oh, she didn't wash cars like me. She, she didn't walk the Brooklyn Cheesecake. She didn't walk the Brooklyn Cheesecake. But I felt like at the time, like, yo, I could have felt that way when Diddy had me in the house and they yeah. brought you back. Because remember, it was me and me in the house, and then they brought Babs back. Yeah. I didn't hate one time. I was That's like, let's bring her. That's you a know? fact. But then when it came down to me, mm -hmm. it was like, you know, ha, you know? Because mm -hmm. so, they knew I, you was over, son. Yeah, yeah they knew. <laughs> <laughs> you know? So I'm going to leave that open. But shout out Babs. I love when we talk. You know, we say we love each other. That sis right there, you know. Yeah. Um, Chopper. <laughs> <laughs> Chopper plays the 48 Laws of Power to a T. Mm -hmm. He is a chess player, and I mean, this boy is a chess player. <laughs> like, he would conspire with you. You yeah, know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, that time I was screaming in the house. Y'all remember that when I was, you was yeah. Yeah. He, he was, was screaming out the window. <laughs> but guess who got blamed? Mysterious upstairs <laughs> while it was me and him. You know what uh, I'm saying? It's been time. <laughs> me and him conspired to do something. Yeah. I'll do it. And then he over there like, you know? Yeah. And then, like, Chopper yeah. is a, 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 a chess player. Okay. He's very smart. Okay. That's what I'm trying to say. He's very, 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 very smart. Dylon. <laughs> Top five all time. Dylon, 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 No shout out to Dylon. <laughs> no shout out to No shout out to No shout out to Oh, man, that's I'm put it out there while I say that, you know, because I, when I see Dylon, you know, he see, we just see each other at the uh, VMAs, and he's like, oh, you looking good, you know, and you know, we always got to keep this politically mm -hmm. correct, right. but when I first came home from prison, I was working on this uh, show called Kitty City, right, Okay. and I brought him into the fold. You know, so the lady... <laughs> That's a great look. The, the, yeah, the lady said, yeah, you know, I was talking to Dylon, and da-da-da-da-da, and he said that I shouldn't trust you because of your charge. Oh, snap. So he kicked my back in behind my back. 
Yo. Yeah, you definitely know no shout out. So that was like, no shout out, darling. And I was so mad. Like, yeah. my people was like, yo, we need to get. I'm like, and I said, no, I'll breathe easy because I'm going to be the Oprah Winfrey of the hip hop game. You Talk to me, Miss He's going to have to see me one day, you know, uh, for real to get a job. That's a fact. Know? No, that's a fact. Yeah, that's that's a fact. So, that's, that's so it's like, I got genuine love for people, but when I found out he did that, that's right. why I just want to be politically just say no shout out to now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because my charge is very, very postpartum psychosis is something that um, is serious. Right. Mm. That, that's serious amongst black women, women, right. period. You know? Yeah. And I never thought, I didn't wake up one day and say, you know, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that. Yeah. You know, it's, it's really a, it was a mental situation yeah, yeah, yeah chemical imbalance so right, right. for people who to make fun of me or you know kick my back in about that or oh, she crazy and not really understand the 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 psychologicalness and all that thing you know sh no shout out to you for real no shout no out, shout out. <laughs> especially he trying to ruin bags over here yeah, yeah he can't mess the bag up son no shout out he, tried, he did ruin That's my bag crazy. My, and then it's like and the crazy part about Kitty City, no shout out to Kitty City. But <laughs> <laughs> the crazy thing about Kitty City was I was bringing everybody, like all the talent, all the acts and different mm. things like that. So it got really, really greasy with people. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. I couldn't believe Dylan did that to me. Yeah. Dylan, what's up, bro? You gotta come see me now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just cause. Uh, now I don't know, man. You might you might be calling our people. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I got charged. Hey, look, know. Don't hey, look know. we, we might, might have to have Minister Farrakhan. You know what I mean? You know I'm the minister. Oh man, that's wild. That's wild. Yo, that's crazy. Cause I'm just thinking, like, man, from making the band, and then you had, uh, you know, you're doing your Misty Blanco stuff now. And it's like, you really got longevity in this game. Yes. Like, you probably yes. got a lot of information. You yes. probably know a lot of stuff. Yes. You probably still got, like, people in the industry yeah. who you know. 20 years. Yeah, Jigga. yo, and that's something to say. Because people... Jigga. That's 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 <laughs> he told me the illest thing, Jay-Z. Yeah, you can't just be saying, oh, shut up. She like, can't just name drop. Hold on. Nah, nah, nah. Wait, let me say no shout out to Jigga. Like, wait, wait, wait. You heard me like, yo, who's Jigga? Yo, shout out to Jigga. Like, that's my guy. Like, yo, like, who's Jigga? Like, let's get into that now. The GOAT. 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 I need a moment of silence for that. I, I agree with what we all do. So. I asked Jay Z. <laughs> I asked Jay Z in the studio. I said, "Um, how did you make it?" I'm yeah. thinking he's gonna say what I've been doing. Like you got to spend all these hours mm. in the studio. You got to on the pavement. He looked at me so cool and said, "Once everybody is on the same page, then you gonna make it." Mm. He said, "The hardest thing to do is to get everybody on your team on the same page. Mm. Once you get everybody on the same page, you out of here." Cause everybody got ulterior motives. You gotta make sure the motive is Boy. Ready. Mm. That's bad. <sighs> That's and heavy. Back then I was Go like, hey, look, back then I was like, hmm? yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, 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 yeah. About, like, I'm like, you remember? I'm starting to do this song, man. <laughs> like, you know, you know, you tell me that I gotta, you know, go in that encyclopedia. And, right. You know, right. 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 and it was so simple, but so deep because now that I am where I am, I'm finally getting everybody on the same page. Mm. Dope. It took years because I didn't have managers who try to take my fame. Oh, you I didn't have people who try to block me. I didn't have people who say everything was them and don't give me no credit. I didn't have people try to extort me. That's crazy. I didn't have bullies. I didn't have all what? That's and then, nuts. And it'd be people you be caught. Man, man, no shout man. out to um Prince Ock and them, you know what I'm saying? No oh shout out. Shout out. So many no shout outs. You know right. What I'm <laughs> shout out to Jay Z. <laughs> shout out to Jay Z. But I had to, I had to where people, you know, I done got in the top ten in thirty countries, did certain things, and then a certain particular person came in the hood, uh, Kevin Glickman, you know, white dude, no shout out because you split up the team. Mm -hmm. No. People got with him, got certain deals, and then they just ex Misty out. Yeah. But I thought we all was on you the same was on page. But soon 
That's why you gotta watch your squad, man. Because it, it, soon it somebody come with that money, fam, or opportunity. Money. Yo, that's crazy. You say that because, like, yo, like even biblically, like, yo, they was trying to build a tower to go to heaven. Yeah. And God was like, "Whoa, they on the same page." God on the same page. Let me <laughs> mess this up. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You know what I mean? Like, yo, that's crazy. Because, like, yo, when everybody's on one accord and everybody wants to do the same thing and got the same goals, that's dangerous. Yes, and that's what's going on with me now. Wow. I'm I'm, I'm coming. It's like a... I got to... Can I tell them what we're meeting with? Let's talk. Yeah. Talk. Yeah. Exclusive. We gotta. We gotta. Uh, Christina, do you see how quiet she yeah, is? Yeah, 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 yeah. Christina she, chilling I, right I, now. I wanna oh, say, put my hoodie on for this. I want to say shout out to Christina. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> she's amazing. She's an angel. I met her how many weeks ago? A couple weeks ago. Yeah, about three. And she's been my assistant since. Oh. Like, um, she's amazing, and <laughs> she's taking me because, actually to carry a corner. Oh, dope. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we can make this Rise of the Fiery Phoenix. Let's go, Oprah. Big. Oh, yeah. Oprah. Yeah. Oprah. Yeah. Oprah. 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 That's your name. Oprah. 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 Because of Christina. <laughs> Christina Let's talk about that. Now, now listen, I'm not even going to hold you. I don't got no love for Peter's Bird. Yo, he's bugging. He's bugging. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got to have love for the bird. Let me tell you man. why, though, bro. Tell so me. I went I went to Virginia State, which is in Petersburg, right? Real State. Yo, this like, there's just something like a cloud of like <laughs> something over Petersburg. Which I feel that like make you like it. Exactly, oh, you're not gonna say it. Like, you can, <laughs> like I'm surprised Trey Songz got out. To, to be honest. Oh, the hate. No, like the hate the and like just the vibe and like lit. like that's the it's this cloud of like Kitty stress. Kittyburg is like Baltimore. It's the streets. Nah, yo, Baltimore's popping. I like Baltimore. You want you want to hear something so crazy? I can't even front. I um for part of the show, um because I was helping a particular person, uh, a friend, uh. With his campaign, you know, but um, moving a, moving yo, forward, moving forward. <laughs> yo, yo, I can't, yo, I can't with y'all. <laughs> yo, the shade is real on the show. <laughs> moving oh forward, God. we ended up at Pecan Acres. <laughs> oh, <stop. laughs> yo, what? But I want to say this: Pecan Acres showed me love. Pecan shout Acres. Acres, shout out to the Acres because, damn it, man. Yeah. I done been in every hood that you could think of. Mm -hmm. I done been over there in Compton, you know, Bompton, as they say. Mm -hmm. I done been, you know, down in New Orleans. I done been everywhere. There there ain't was. nothing like PK. <laughs> man, listen. I got angel. on the video, man, they got choppers out that mug. You know what I'm saying? I could have not made it out of that mug. Damn. But guess what? I'm right here. I love y'all. PK and Acre. They let me be safe though because we had a show mm. and everybody that I had on the show was not from Virginia. Uh. They drove up from North Carolina. We could have, when we had to get the night ended crazy, y'all gotta watch the documentary. Um, the stage got left <laughs> in the middle. In the middle of the acres. Shout out to the acres. Yo, what? And it wasn't for the them. It wasn't. It wasn't the That's acres. Crazy. It was my people. So what ends up happening? We had to get this. <laughs> we had to get the stage away from the acres, but nobody robbed us. <laughs> That's nobody a miracle. shot us. <laughs> Oh, Nobody. Uh, boy. They showed us love and shout out to uh, Free Free Longway. They had uh, educated me on him too, the upcoming rapper that they had. Yeah. Coming, you know, so yeah. it, they really did show me some love out there. That's dope. They That's did. dope. They did. I'm I just saying, they need a little dangerous. more prayer. They, um, okay. Dude, talk about still yeah, yeah. Do we need some prayer, but it's still lit. I don't know. Lit. I'll let y'all bring that, you know. Yeah, just, I'll let y'all bring that. What you like? Four dollars roll? I'll just take credit once it happens. Yeah, I'm <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm <laughs> all I can in them shoes. <laughs> now look, now look. So me and Shaq are avid battle rap fans. We love, we love battle rap, right? And you said you have relationships with Babs, you know what I'm saying? She's all in the battle rap as yeah, well. She do her thing. She and then, thing. you know, you're from no Detroit way. and you like yeah. came down under the whole, you know, battle rap and circuit almost, you know, like uh, your uh, underground stuff. Would you ever consider getting in battle rap? Because I feel like today's battle rap. I feel like you can get in it. Yeah, I would. I would. You would? 
I will. I will consider. So there's there's battle rappers from I Detroit. You know you know a lot of them like you know Calico. You know I don't really know. X Factor. You know them. That's like why that. I would come oh. and get in there. Just, come and just you can get in, yo. Just be legit. This is whole yo. Bad Babs, yo. Yeah, hit Babs. 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 No, no. There's only one person I want to battle if they can make it happen. Ooh. Remy Ma. Ooh. I, now I ain't gonna hold you. Hold on, hold on. I'm from Brooklyn. I'm from Brooklyn. Listen, Remy. So uh, that's I'm one. sorry. I'm um, cheating. I think sorry. that would be the battle of the century. It would. You know that would because be hard. I know Remy. She gonna come. Shout out Remy. I love you. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. Uh, the industry needs to see some, 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 yeah, some. I, I agree. And I feel like you know. Um, when after Nicki Minaj and I was listening to that whole thing, like, come on, why you beating up on somebody who you, <laughs> yeah, she, you just she you just pummel somebody who you, you know she got yeah. why you gonna play her butt like right. you have to like, <laughs> like, let you leave her alone that's, that's Nicki let her be because I, I love you Nicki shout out Nicki but I, and then you know she battled my people Lady Luck before you know Lady what I'm Luck is that's fire. my that's my sister Fight Club Lady is, Luck is fight, I like Fight fire. Club day Fight Club Luck was in a battle with official. And was smoking in the battle, blowing smoke in her face. While she I, mean, battled. I was like, nah, luck is wild. So. I would battle Remy. You wouldn't battle luck? Uh, I, uh, you got three rounds for luck. I feel you definitely got three yeah, rounds. Yeah, I, I got to kick up, though. Luck, luck, yeah, luck, luck is luck, different. Luck different. Luck different. <laughs> she, she do this. Really, she really, yeah. like, she was on my show not too long ago. Right. That's my sis. I call her up. That's my people. But, um, Fire. Remy Ma. I just need that. <laughs> you need that smoke. You, you sound like you want that smoke. Yeah, Yo, you she want that. She right? sound like she want. Like, Smack, set it up. Bab, set it up. Papu, set it up, boy. The thing with Remy, okay? Mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you right now how she will come at me. So, so, so when you come writing your bars or having whoever write them mm. or whatever, she's gonna come at me after my charge. You get, you get mm. what I'm saying? I already got something for that. Okay. So I'm let you know. I already got something for that. Let's go. Um, okay. You're gonna come at me for the making of band days. I didn't uh. work for no cheesecake. Uh. Yeah, I got, you, you know what I mean? Mm. So talk dirty um, to it. Another thing you gonna come at what my weight or my height? Come on, come on, Remy, come on. And no. please do not come up with the the, the, the mask off and shoot me up because Woo! you know it's I a like lot this of things that I want to say. She's talking right now. Like, so I ain't gonna like, hold you. Cause, Listen, because I will come on some some straight up real like. I don't you know? like. I don't if know. somebody it, come it, at my charge, I'll come at George for shooting your best friend. You know Woo! what I'm saying? Like at the all end right, of the right. day. Like, <laughs> Yo, somebody I, set this I, I up. I mean, it is. Yo, it call is. Babs, man. Tell yeah, Babs yeah, she yeah, gotta yeah. set this up. And, and we gotta Babs put this on. We gotta put this on. A pay per view. I need some money. Like, That's yeah, a fact. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> nah, you gotta get a pay per Yeah, yeah caffeine. We need that caffeine, bro. You gotta do Word. This, so. That's crazy. Nah, I, I would definitely That's like the, to see that. That's, I ain't gonna That's hold you, though. I ain't gonna hold you. And I love you, Remy. Like, I don't want you to think, like, oh, you know how people, like, she'll be like, yo, fuck that man. Right, right, right. Come right. shoot me. Yeah, like, yeah, listen, yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I, I just got off parole. I ain't got no hands. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? This thing is over with me. I She's like, yo, no if you're watching this, I have no I have, hammers. I have no hammers. No hammers. And <laughs> it is what it is, but we're going to do this for love. We're going to do this for hip hop. And even That's if right. you trash me, I'm going to make sure I get paid. You know what I'm saying? I'm Don King. You know? Dive check. <laughs> you got to dive check. <laughs> you know, but she's definitely somebody I want to that's yeah. dope. That's dope. That's dope. Shaq, you good? I'm good, man. I'm just right now. I'm, I'm feeling the smoke. Like she really want Remy. Like, like she really want smoke. Like for me, I'm never gonna go against anybody from home. No, so don't do it. Don't I'm never do gonna it. go don't against anybody from home. So I'm. A, I feel like Remy gonna smoke. But yeah. you know what I'm saying? She can, she I, I think I want to see it. Yeah, she's a smoke me, you know what I'm saying? But see, the thing, the difference between me and Remy is I can change up on her. I can mm. sing. Mm. I'll mm. sing on her in battle. You know mm. what I'm saying? I'll take her, I'll take her voice you know, in battle. Like, like, yo, you know what I'm saying? Talk this like, talk, Mickey Mouse. <laughs> I want. You know, she stick with the same, you know what I mean? I might come back sound like Mickey Mouse in battle. It don't, it don't matter. Like, it is what it yeah, is. Yeah, I'm saying that. Like, yo, she better call Babs. Babs, set it up. We're going to do this in Richmond. We're going to do this in Richmond. Let's make it happen. Neutral grounds. We got to get neutral grounds because we can't take this to the East Coast. Or Detroit. Or Detroit, you know what I mean? Let's no, we definitely ain't going to Trick Trick ain't having it. <laughs> 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 what? You know you lost that. Yeah, Trick Trick ain't having it. You know you lost that. The BMF dudes, none of them. No, we're not messing with none of Detroit. <laughs> 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 Shout out Uncle Meech, you know what I'm saying?
saying? Yeah, my mom said, rapped with him back in black the day. Blackface. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm all set, blackface. I don't want no smoke yeah. with you, son. But like I said, it's all love. We shouldn't have no gun split spilling, no blood right, spilling. Right, right. This is just for hip hop. So Remy, if you with it, what a I'm culture. Ready. What a culture. What a culture. Right. culture. You know what I'm saying? Even if you trash me, at least I get to say I got trashed by Remy. 100%. Yeah, yeah, that's that's right. Right. Look, and I don't <laughs> think that's going to happen. You know yeah, what I'm saying? So let's Yo, that's dope. Listen, we appreciate you, yo. We appreciate you coming through. We got ghost friends. Everybody got ghost friends. Yeah, she got ghost No, she don't. You, you be surprised. Yeah, she sound like Pat, man. Come on now. Pat, yeah, that's she around Pat all the time. Right, we're not doing this. All right, yo, close the show. Look at that lady. Close the show. I ain't going front. Listen, listen. I, listen, if I'm in a studio, right, and I'm writing, you know what I'm saying, I'm doing my thing, it's been a couple of people that have been like, I'll say this, say that. They're right. Out there, at least I'm blunt about it. Come yeah. On. But they ain't writing whole they ain't verses They ain't writing whole verses, you. but nah. come on, Remy. I said it, so come see it. Hey, look, come see it. <laughs> yo! Come yo, see it, Remy. Close the show up. You're not doing this to Rim right now. We gotta go. We gotta go. Listen, Misty Blanco, appreciate you coming through. Yeah, for sure. Definitely not the last time. Uh, give everybody your socials. Um, You can follow me on Instagram at Misty Blanco. Uh, Twitter, Misty Blanco. Uh, Snapchat, Misty Blanco. Uh, Instagram, Misty Blanco. Uh, or you can go on my business page, the Misty TV. Um, Facebook is the same, um, Misty Blanco, but it's the one with the V's in there. Because I got, like, <laughs> different pages. If y'all really want to talk to me, it's the one with the V's in there, you know? Word, word. Check. And y'all can check this interview out. Uh, the link is in the bio. Uh, hit us up. Follow us at Fake Famous Podcast. I'm sorry. I keep saying it wrong. Instagram. Fake, 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 Fake Famous <laughs> Everything. <laughs> You can get the podcast, you can get the t-shirts, everything. you can get the hats, everything. all that good stuff. So on Fake Famous Everything, everything. on the uh, Instagram. Listen, we out here, we in these streets, you know what time it is. Yeah! Bang, bang, bang. <laughs> then we out. Thank you, that was fun. Thank yeah, you. Was Thank you. Thank you. I'm sorry oh, about it, cool, but it's, it's for the culture, man. We it's for the culture, man. <laughs> it's for the culture, man. <laughs>